guys and welcome back to my channel. If you have been here for some time, you have noticed that over the last six months I've made a lot of videos called like how to get your life in order, how to schedule your day, how to be productive, how to adult, so on and so forth. It is no surprise that I try to put as much as I can within the 24 hours that I get each and every day. And today I wanted to share with you guys three productivity apps that I have been using in the last three months that I thought would really help you guys if you are also trying to make the most of your day. All of these apps are 100% completely free, but without any further ado, let's jump into the video. The first app is a money saving app and what I love about this is I don't have to do anything but install it and set it up under my account. The app is called Ernie and what it does is it tracks all of your retail purchases. For example, if I go and buy a brand new sofa on Saturday for $1,000 and then in the next two weeks it goes on sale for $800. Ernie will shoot out a claim to my credit card that I bought it from and the company I purchased it from. It basically does all the hard work of getting me that $200 refund that would take me weeks to get. Side note, you also know I just purchased a house and I have to tell you the most expensive part of buying a house is furnishing it. And Ernie makes me feel very comfortable if I go out and buy something. If it goes on sale in a couple weeks and I really don't want to wait and I know I will have Ernie there to back me up, if something goes on sale, it tracks everything. Ernie covers retail stores like Sears, J. Crew, Costco, Best Buy, Walmart, Nordstrom, Nike, Banana Republic, Staples, the list goes on and on. The two places that I get the most refunds personally are Amazon.com and Kohl's. And honestly, the refunds could be as small as like five or six dollars or as much as a couple hundred dollars. From somebody who has stood in line at customer service to get that refunded price when something went on sale, I cannot tell you how much time and how much money that app can save you. If you guys want to check out that app, I will have a link listed down below. You can just click it and read all about it, see the reviews and get a little more further information. I cannot recommend that to you enough. It is like having a little financial guru in your back pocket that checks everything you've purchased within the last 120 days and make sure that you got the best deal on every retail purchase. The next app I want to talk to you guys about is called Tide. Tide really helps me focus on one thing at a time. I like to multitask. I really used to pride myself that I could do 20 different things at once, but now I'm trying to shift my gears and really focus in on one thing at a time. What Tide does is it sets a timer for 25 minutes. It'll play different kinds of music in the background and you can choose whatever you want. And then when that 25 minutes is over, it will tell you to take a break for maybe five to 10 minutes and then you go back and focus for another 25. For me, this helps me during my day job. If I have to write a report or get something ready or coordinate a meeting, I can just set the timer and go and focus. Or if I'm trying to make sure that I only spend so much time on my YouTube channel or working with clients or consulting, I will set that up and when that timer goes off, I respect that it went off and I respect the fact that I am taking a break. Work-life balance achieved. Well, as close as you can get to real work-life balance. Again, if you wanna check that app out, it is also available in the App Store. And lastly is my favorite project management app. It is called Todoist. It works kind of like Google Calendar, only you can bring people onto your projects. For example, when I'm designing a website or doing a collaborative video, me and my partners can all get on our app Todoist. It'll have a list of things that have to get done. We can assign those tasks to different people so we all know who is responsible for what. There's no he said, she said. It is all listed out for you in one easy app. Once you do download Todoist, there is a class you can take on a website called Skillshare. It explains how the app works, how to invite people, how to set up various projects, because you can have an unlimited amount of projects going on. This is how a lot of people that do like consulting, build websites, or anything that involves a large number of people working towards one main goal. It's these type of apps that help keep everybody on the same page. And just like those last two, Todoist is also available in the App Store. Anyway, those are the top three productivity apps that I cannot recommend enough to you guys. Whether you're trying to save money or keep yourself on a work-life balance or kind of just keep all your projects together while you're working with other people, these three apps are a game changer. For me personally, I do keep Tide and Todoist in a time management folder, and I keep Ernie in a folder called Money Management, and it is also sitting next to my Chase Bank app. 
because they are linked together. Once again, all of the information for all the apps discussed linked down below in the description box. If you have an app that you really think would change someone's productivity or life in general for the better, go ahead and leave it down below in the description box. If you like these kind of videos, make sure to give this one a thumbs up. And if you are not yet subscribed, click that little red subscription button down below. It'll update you each and every time I upload a video. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.